so for this craft you will need a ruler, scissors, a glue stick, sharpies, you at least need a black one but I would I would say that you need a colored one too just for the colored part of the eye, um, a pencil, and the most important part is probably the paper. I'm using a printed one but you can use like a solid color purple or green one whatever you want. And then you'll also just be needing some normal paper that you print on just for like the teeth and the eyes and stuff like that. Okay, so find where 5 inches is on your ruler, set it down right here on your paper, and you're going to mark where 5 inches is. I've already done this, so I'm just explaining the steps. Then you're going to mark where 2 and a half is, which is half of 5 for you guys who don't really know, <laughs> um, and you're going to mark that too. Then you're going to turn it and do the same on this side here, and we're just working with the corner here. Then from those points that you're marked, you're going to draw these lines like this so that they form this shape. It's just a line here and here and here and here, sort of like an L. Then you're going to do like this, which I haven't done yet. You're going to mark a diagonal across here and here. So you're going to cut it along those lines. So that is the next step. Okay, so you're going to cut here, and then here, and then here, and then here. And just move this other piece aside. So you're going to have a shape like this. Now the next step that you're going to do is you're going to fold along this line and this line. Now as you can see, sadly, my paper isn't printed the color on both sides, so I'm actually going to use these little triangles right here that we didn't cut out in a sec to cover up this white part. Okay, so fold those on those lines there. I just folded them like this. Ding, ding. Now you're going to take your glue stick, and I'm just going to use this little piece of paper that I had. Like, for right now, I'm going to lay it down so that I can glue on top of it to not get glue all over the floor. And I'm only placing glue on one of the little triangles, the one that you fold down first. So that then when you fold down this one, they stick to each other and you create a little pouch right here. And then I'm just going to fold this down like so. And stick it. So now you've created this little pouch right here. Now if the, the paper that you're using has color on both sides and isn't just printed on one side, then you can actually skip this next step. But what I'm going to do is take only one of these little triangles that I hadn't used before, because you're not really going to need the other one, and I'm just going to cut it out. So then you're just going to put some glue and you are going to glue that down right there. The next steps to do is adding the eyes and the teeth. Now if you want to just have sort of a, a pretty looking bookmark thing, you can even leave this like this and just put that on the corner of your page, which that would look pr really pretty. Let me show you how that would look. I've got my book here the best book ever and same on this page so I'm just gonna put this on the corner like that and that would actually be really pretty and then you would just be able to close your book like that and that would be a really cute bookmark but since this is a monster bookmark which I think is a lot cuter we're going to do the decorating steps next so the next step would be this um you're since we're doing the teeth you're just gonna measure this diagonal right here which is three and a half inches and I just you know went like this on the paper measured three and a half inches and cut a little rectangle now you would think we'd start cutting out the teeth right now but actually I want to make this like a little um, pocket that so it'll fit in here better so that's really easy you're just gonna 
snip the ends, edges like this. Once you have that little pocket thingy, it's not really a pocket, you, you can just, so that it can fit in here. You're going to cut the teeth and you could draw out how you want to cut the teeth, but I'm just going to go for it. Okay. That's my little sister laughing. And, um, so those are just going to fit in right there. Really cute. And so you're going to just, the next step I'm not going to show, but you're going to just apply some glue here so that you can stick this, like, at the roof of his mouth almost inside that pocket. Once you have made your little eyes for your monster, I just use green right here and then black. Um, the final step is just to glue these on your monster. How you put them on, you just take your little pouch part and slip it. I can't even see what I'm doing. Slip it right here on your book. And I think they're really fun. And you'll get lots of compliments for using them. And I actually like this one that I made for you guys in the tutorial better than the original one that I did when I was testing it out. And I was thinking of giving this one to my little sister, but now I'm thinking I'll keep this one and give her this one. But anyways, thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you want to see more cool videos like this. And actually, oh look, I made this with um, ribbon, and I'm going to be uploading a tutorial soon on how to make one of these. Subscribe for awesomeness.